Okay guys, I'm outside and I want to show you the craziest fucking storm right now. Look at these clouds. And I can't tell if they're spinning. Um, but just the other day we had a huge tornado, not a huge, but it was a huge storm, but it was a, um, a small tornado touched down here in, in the town I live in. And it blew a lot of shit around. But this is like really ominous looking. It's coming from this direction, which is east. It's like northeast this way. Um, but I'm going to do a quick little show of my garden. My sunflowers are all opening. Oh, it looks like they're going to get blown over. I hope not. Um, here I planted a St. John's wort. And I put some solar lights in, and they're going over around this right here. I better get in the house, because this storm is really bad looking. But you can see my zinnias over here. Cabbage, strawberries, fennel, all that stuff. Um, look at the, look at the teepee, you guys. Oh, it's starting to get bad lightning. I better get in the house. Um, but pepper, I'm just gonna do a little quick overview, show everything to you guys. Show you how big it's getting. Yeah, this storm is crazy looking and it's really scary. Um, it does look like it's spinning, but I'm gonna go in the house. Actually, I'm gonna go to the front porch, then I'll show you. Let's walk into the front. Watch out, kitties. I'm trying to keep the cats inside because that storm is looking pretty scary. Um, so, yeah, oh man, that is looking ominous, and it doesn't help when there's like sirens, you can hear sirens everywhere, okay, so let's go out here and see what it looks like from the front, see over there, it, um, it's kind of clear, but I don't trust it. And over there you can see. Let's just sit and see what it does. As you can see over that way. Yeah, the storm's coming from that way. Northeast. I had to move all my plants. Uh, for the last few days, it's been like a daily thing to move all of my um, plants that are on my porch so they don't get soaking wet. Have y'all ever been in storms like this? I mean, I'm just lucky I live in the mountains and I don't think I could live anywhere that it's flat. That would scare me too much too much uh, possibilities but you can see there's the ridge this way that is to the south uh, Kingsport is on the other side of that ridge well not Kingsport it's like Weber City Kingsport um, yeah so my front door faces south and I get all the eastern sun in the morning in my windows this, I found out what kind of tree this is, you guys. This is a sourwood tree. Um, and they only grow in the Appalachian Mountains. And... Oh, I smell the rain coming, you guys. Apparently, um, honey made from those... Cause see all those, like, panicles on there? Those are all flowers. And honey made from those specific flowers and that specific tree is, like, the most... It's, like, the rarest honey in the world and the most expensive, I guess. Here comes the rain. Um, usually you can see it coming. I can definitely smell it. But look how big everything is getting out here. The other day when I showed you guys, um, it was nighttime and you couldn't really see anything. Uh, here, the palladium. 
jasmine tree. Uh, look at this. See, now you can kind of see how big it is. But it's a really big chair. Uh, the coleus. It's still there. Now you can kind of see how pretty the color is in real life. It's really a deep red. And there is a praying mantis living in there. See if you can see him right in there. He is right there. There's praying mantis all over my garden. There's like probably 50 of them. They're all just babies still. And they're really cute. But they do get big. Um, last year I had a praying mantis in my garden that was like from my wrist to the tip of my finger. And it like lived on my, one of the structures I had built in the backyard. Um, it lived on it. And it was really, they're really nice if, if you don't bother them. They, they're really cute. The ones down here are green, and then their wings are whatever, their backs are brown, and the males are like smaller. But I just want to show you guys that storm because the sky looked really pretty, and yeah, hope you guys are having a good day. I'll see you in the next one.